Hello everyone! Today, I'm going to be showing you how to use the Metal Building 3D Designer tool on the Smartland Commercial Contractors website. First, head on over to smartland.com slash commercial contractors. On the home page, you will see a big button that will take you to the Metal Building 3D Designer. Once you're there, you can adjust your view by clicking and dragging your mouse. You can zoom in and zoom out using the magnifying glasses at the upper right hand of your screen. Also, if you're using a mouse that has a scrolling wheel, you can use that to zoom in and zoom out as well. As you can see, starting out, you have two models, one of a person and another of a vehicle for scale. So let's get into the features. The first is the building size. You can adjust the width, the length, the height, and the pitch of your building. You can also decide if you want a single slope or standard roof. The next feature to go over are overhangs. You can use the slider or the arrows to add overhangs to either the sides or the ends of your building. Next are the lean-tos. You can add a lean-to to any one of the walls of your building. Let's put one on the right and put our car under there. You can adjust the width, the cuts, pitch, and the drop of your overhangs. If you add two overhangs adjacent to each other and hit the wrap button, they will wrap around. Now note that both of these have to be equal measurements in order to use the wrap feature. Our next option to go over are the doors and windows. You'll start with two windows and one door, and you can move those around pretty freely. You have many options to add doors or windows. You can select which wall you want, and then you can select between a variety of windows, doors, and roll-ups. Add them to your building and move them to where you want them. And if there's something you don't like on your building, you can easily hit the trash can button to delete it. Also on this screen, you can make the walls transparent so you can see how your framing looks. You can also lock position. Now none of your objects will move. If you zoom in, you can actually enter your building and see it from the inside. Other features include enabling the wainscot, adding the gutters to your building, and adding your ridge vent. There are two types, standard or low. And you can also determine whether you want them spread or not. The next feature is the color customization. Here you can determine what color you're building and all the features on the building look like. Next, you can determine whether you want insulation or not. This won't necessarily change anything on your screen, but it will affect the quote. Finally, in the extra options, you can quickly choose which view you want of your building. And you can also change the scene, in case you want to see how it would look in a scene maybe more accurate to one that you would be seeing it in. And finally, you can include or exclude the models. And when you're all finished up and the building looks the way you want it, you can click the Get a Quote, enter your name, your email address, and your phone number. and then you can send your request. So that's how to use the Metal Building 3D Designer tool on the Smartland Commercial Contractors website. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed.